Now assume I give you a graph G. A graph is basically a bunch of vertices and some edges. I show you the, such a graph here and I ask you, can you tell me what are the weak ties here? How can you tell me? How do you know what is the intensity of friendship here? You obviously cannot tell me or can you? Look at the underlying graph, the graph that is shown here. Remember this graph is actually, we discussed about this graph. You do not have to remember, I will help you recollect it. There are 25 nodes this side and 25 nodes that side. And there is only one friendship from someone this side to someone that side. First of all, there are 625 possible friendships between these two clusters. Because there are 25 this side, 25 that side. Total possible is 625. Out of which I am saying there is only one friendship happening here. All right, fine. Let us assume the graph is like this. Do you sense that this particular edge here, this red colored edge is actually a weak tie? Is not that obvious? Because this person is in some other island altogether and in this island, this person knows a lot of people that this person does not know. Mainly, I am saying B knows a whole lot of people that A does not know and A and B are friends with each other. Now, A and B by definition, do you think it should be a weak tie? Now, you can tell me, uh, how do you know it is a weak tie? Maybe they are good friends. Well, that is uh, slightly not possible, uh, probably not possible for a simple reason that if they were good friends, let us say A and B were good friends then B has a lot of friends there and A should also be friends with them because of triadic closure, correct? Given that triadic closure is not happening itself is an indication of the fact that A and B are weak, they form a weak tie, their friendship is not intense. Now, remember what I said a while back? I said there are 625 possible friendships, there is only one friendship happening. Ah, oh, this is rare, such a structure may not even exist in real life. So, this such a edge is called a bridge. The definition of a bridge is basically this. You remove that uh, edge, the graph becomes disconnected, okay? That is the definition. Now, this does, definition does not seem to be uh, of any help because we may not see such structures. If we see such structures, then we know it is a weak tie. We may not see such structures. So, I am going to relax this definition slightly and I am going to define what is called a weak bridge. It is actually called the local bridge, but it is intuitive on my mind to call it a weak bridge. So, what is a local bridge? Local bridge is a bridge, an edge without any triad on the either sides of the vertices. A and B is called a local bridge if there is no triad on them, not even a single triad. Now, do you see every bridge is a local bridge by definition? Because a bridge means what? A and B do not have any common friends nor is there a path from A to B apart from the AB edge, correct? So, AB is a local bridge if there is no triad on it. As you can see from the figure here in this example, AB is not a bridge but is a local bridge because there is no triad on it, correct? Now, such local bridges are also can also be considered as a weak tie. Why? Think about it. Here again, A is friends with B, A B is a local bridge. None of B's friends A knows. Why? If A were to know a B's um, a friend, that would sort of uh, result in a triad on A and B, you see. So, 
none of B's friends A knows, none of A's friend B knows. Sounds like a weak tie, you see. So, um, uh, Granovitter actually observed that these local bridges are what forms, is, is what uh, one means by a weak tie, it forms a weak tie. Huh? And a weak tie mostly is a local bridge, they both do not have a common friend. So, this is the definition of local bridge and this is where Ganovetter argued that such weak ties is what resulted in A being friends with someone who connects him to a different island altogether from where a very very good opportunity can knock his door through B. I am going to um, explain a very nice way in which we can analyze the local bridges that we just now discussed. So, what is a local bridge? A local bridge between two people is that edge, that relationship where let us say A and B, A and B are friends. You call this friendship as local bridge if there are no common friends. Right? For example, as you can see, A and B are friends and A is uh, uh, on the left side, B is on the right side and there are a lot of friendships for B, a lot of friendships for A, but A and B do not have a common friend. A and E they have common friends, A and D have common friends, but A and B do not have common friends. This is called a local bridge. Here goes my question, let me write that down. And the question which we are going to ask and answer right now is the following. What can one say about these local bridges? Are they strong ties or weak ties? We saw strong ties, we saw weak ties, we discussed about the strength of weak ties, right? We saw local bridges. Now I am asking this question Are local bridges, are they? strong ties or weak ties. By this I mean A and B are friends and this A and B, do they enjoy very close friendship or is their friendship very weak? Something in me tells me that it is indeed a weak tie. Why? Let us try looking at it uh, uh, mathematically. Let us discuss logically why one can actually show that it is a weak tie. What am I trying to say? Let us say as a uh, real world analogy, all I am saying is if I were to have a friend in let us say um, Indonesia, will I be very good friends with this person? Firstly, it is the proximity, right? We may not meet each other very regularly, but that aside. If I were to have a friend with, Indo, uh, with someone in Indonesia, will that friendship be very strong? Looks like no is the answer. There could be exceptions, but mostly no. When you have friendship across two different clusters, the way I have showed uh, here, as you can see, this is a cluster, this is another cluster, right? Between these two clusters, if there is a friendship, that is mostly a weak friendship. How? Why? What makes me say this? Let us look at it mathematically. Okay. So, now assume this A, let me just write A here once again, A and a B and there is friendship here. A has 
a lot of friends let us say ok. Forget this case I am looking at another situation A has a lot of friends and you see some of A's friends let us say A has assume A has A has 50 friends out of which 5 are strong friendships, strong ties. What do I mean by this? A, we all have friendships, some of them are uh, close, some of them are not so close. A has 50 friends and let us say 5 of them are very, very close. Now, let us look at this in detail. If you see what did I just say, I said if A has 2 very close friendships, really, really close friendships, assume A, um, let me in fact give them some name for clarity sake, assume Assume there is a person called Prakash here and then Raj and then Ram. Prakash is friends with uh, Raj, Prakash is friends with Ram and they are very, very good friends. Their tie is really strong. What can you say about the friendship between Raj and Ram? What can you say about it? Do you think that is also strong? That we cannot say, but for sure there should be friendship between Raj and Ram. Why? Imagine you are really close to two people, very, very close from the past 10 years you are close to these two people. Is there a possibility that these two people do not know each other? Every possibility that you would have made these two people meet each other. I am not saying any two friends of mine know each other. I am only saying if there are two really best friends of mine from a long time, strong friendships, they both will at least know each other. They may not be a strong tie, not necessarily, they could be, not necessarily, but definitely there is a tie between these two people, right. This property which is very straightforward intuitively goes by the name strong it is sort of self explanatory strong triadic closure property. What do we mean by this? We just mean when there is a triad and they are strong, they are closed. That is what I mean here by a strong That is what I mean by a strong triadic, strong, it is a triad and the friendships are strong and that will lead to that triad getting closed always. It is a property that is very easy for us to sort of visualize, right. So, now when this happens, what do you mean by this happens? It, this always happens you see, but all I am saying is if we assume that this property is true in a network, whenever you have two strong friendships, there is a friendship between these two people. So, Raj and Ram become friends. If Prakash is strongly in friendship with Raj and Ram, let us get back to our previous slide. As you can see, A has 50 friends out of which 5 are strong ties. Then let us say A and this uh, person, um, let us say this person uh, uh, Z, A and Z are very close friends. My claim was local bridges are weak ties. Assume A and B was indeed strong tie and A is friends with 5 people with strong ties. So, A and Z 
is let us say strong, see what happens, A is friends with B, A is friends with Z, both are strong friendships. So, what does the triadic closure property say? Let us go and then see, the triadic closure property says that wherever you have two close friends, they are basically friends with each other. So, what happens here? You observe that Z and B will be friends because of the triadic closure property, thus resulting in A and B, thus resulting in A and B not being a local bridge. Why? What is the definition of a local bridge? There are no common friends, but here you see you are seeing a common friend between A and B which is Z, correct? So, what did we just infer? Let us paraphrase. A and B if you assume were local bridge, was a local bridge, then A naturally has a lot of friends and some of them are strong ties. Assume A has at least one strong tie namely Z and A and B is a local bridge. My claim is this local bridge cannot be a strong tie. If it becomes a strong tie, then there should be a, 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 a link between Z and B by the strong triadic closure property which is self explanatory and intuitive, correct, which violates the fact that A B is a local bridge. Okay, logically speaking, a local bridge is mostly a weak tie. So, let me write that down. So, our conclusion is that a local bridge is always rather mostly a weak tie.